we had her in the, in the lineup for a couple of years, but it was just, I guess, for a beer that's probably a few centuries old, is, is a beer that the public wasn't quite ready for. You know, the, the beer market's certainly going in very different directions at the moment, and this is one that's stood the test of time. And, you know, correct me if I'm wrong, but a lot of beers, you know, from centuries gone by would have been smoked. You know, it's one of the few ways to obviously dry kiln, malt and barley, wheat, rye. So a lot of beers would have been smoked. You know, this would have been a normal flavour profile. You throw peat into it and it becomes a very different beast. The same level of bitterness gets cleaned up, palate weight dries out. Those of us that drink peated whiskies will be a big fan of this. It just adds a whole aromatic, complex wonderland for me. You know, you drink of this, you could, you could easily move yourself back in time and 